Despite all of these reopenings, protesters downtown say it is not enough. A large crowd gathered this afternoon for yet another rally to fully reopen San Diego. 10 News reporter Jennifer Kastner spoke with the organizer who is already facing possible charges for two other protests. You're watching some of the dozens of people who showed up this Friday for what they called a freedom rally in their push to fully reopen San Diego. What we're doing to the economy is really bad and what we're doing to Americans is horrible. We need to open up California. It appeared to be a smaller crowd than the one at last Friday's reopen rally near the downtown Hall of Justice. Video from Sky 10 this Friday shows attendees lining the street, waving signs and American flags, some without masks and disregarding social distancing guidelines. A passerby who did not agree with the message had this to say. You may not be able to do what, everything you want, but at least you're alive and eventually you'll be able to. Our rights are being stripped left and right. Just before the rally, 10 News interviewed organizer Naomi Soria, whose case is under review by the city attorney's office after police requested she be charged for violating the county health order after she organized two other protests in April. The restrictions are still very significant and a lot of people are still not able to resume their business as usual. Friday's rally kicks off a weekend of planned demonstrations in at least four other California cities, denouncing the shutdown over the pandemic, calling on Governor Newsom to fully reopen the state. We're Americans. We're Americans and we deserve freedom. We deserve to live like adults. The cure is worse than the virus. Jennifer Kastner, 10 News. San Diego police say there were no arrests or citations at today's rally.